the way that I think about it is that as we as we develop new drugs, I, I feel that um, I, well, I believe that personalized medicine is the defining paradigm for how we're, be, we're going to do discovery and development of drugs over the, over the next few years. Um, when, when we think about truly personalized medicine, actually all of these things have to come together. So we have to have, so the, the biology has to take us in the right direction of which drugs that we, um, which pharmacology we develop. Um, that's going to have to translate into the populations in which we research and develop those drugs. And when we go out into the marketplace um, and we've got drugs that are going to be used in, in populations, it's not going to work unless we have um, electronic medical records, the ability to, you know, personal health records, portable personal health records is, is, is my belief, um, as well as the whole integration of a a practice and a healthcare setup that's geared towards treating the um, the individual with with his or her disease. So all of these things have to come together, and it's quite a long. We've got quite a long way to go in order to do that. We've got to build that kind of infrastructure that enables us to do that, as well as exploiting the biology that's beginning to emerge. But it's going to take a long. It's going to take a long long time for that to do that, to get to that kind of ideal vision where somebody comes into the doctor's office, maybe he or she has a little access card which contains all of his or her medical records, the doctor can access all of the medical records without ever, a patient ever having to sit down and fill out a form, that uh, maybe that individual has complete genomic sequences already because maybe the whole genomic sequence has been, it's been done at birth because it's so cheap and that patient carries that around with him or her for forever. And the doctor is able to go in and he's, he's able to look at the medical records. He's, been a, he's able to integrate in a very complex way with a very simple output the various different factors that go into sort of describing and diagnosing what this patient has and then coming out with a, a, a pretty clear and well-described um, uh, treatment regime for that individual patient, be that, uh, depending on whatever, um, whatever it is that that patient has. And knowing that, that the, the drug, if it's a drug that's going to be given to that patient, is much more likely to be effective and um, much less likely to cause problems. Mm -hmm.